Oh, hey. <laughs> I didn't even hear the bite. I heard him splashing. He's replying to my buddy's text. They're just in the hot corner over there. Hey, rats, that's a farm pond. Feels kind of weird being here. Honestly, I don't fish that many farm ponds because I think they're kind of boring. Most of them have bass, bluegill, and catfish. And while I like the catfish, the fact that you know what you're going to catch is not all that exciting. But this one's a little different. It's got all those things plus some exotics, at least farm pond exotics. And whatever we get, we're going to eat. So let's go. So the main reason I'm here is, is turkeys. No, I haven't put on any weight. I just have four sweatshirts on because it's cold and a pouch full of tackle. But I'm here for turkeys, but there's a pond, so I have to fish it. Well, my plan is to throw some lures and toss some cat rods out. I saw some stuff swimming around in here, so maybe we'll catch them. And for bait, we have the filet mignon to the pond. Probably use part of them for bait and then eat the rest. Actually, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. So I'll take one filet off one side for the catfish and the other side's for me. Hopefully we can add a few more of these too. That would be ideal. I tell you, I don't understand why catfish love crappie so much, but that'd be a lie. Because uh, crappies are delicious and I would understand why anybody would want to eat them. Well, that looks like a good spot. Not very deep, which is good, I think. I don't know, we'll see. We'll go with the old high-low rig. Once we get these set, we're casting. The old one-two punch, I guess you might say. I guess I'll have three rods out, so it'll be the one-two-three punch. Oh, that didn't take very long. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that was easy. Cats like crappie. That's a nice one, too. <laughs> oh, that's a really nice one. I'd laugh because it was just instant. He's hooked really good too. Ow! Ow! Ooh, he even drew a little blood. Oh, he drew a pretty good amount of blood. I guess that's only fair because I'm going to eat you. Well, can't ask for better action than that. Rod goes down with a dandy of a channel cat like before I even get the other rod completely baited this could be fun <laughs> it's already fun can we do that again that would be ideal except for the blood painful biting part turkey in season and crappies would be a little more traditional I suppose but uh, I've never been one to be Normal. <laughs> All right. Keep an eye on those, please. Probably be the only cat I keep. Maybe. Oh, that one did get hit already. Um, he's running at me. Oh, yep, there. He's right there. That was weird. Oh, he's going to get tangled up in that little line. I look funny. I feel like I look funny too. <laughs> wow, just instant. I don't know if he bumped it. He might have bumped it. But that line just went completely slack and he ran all the way. Well, I mean, you're watching, you know. <laughs> Right here. They're cookie cutters, but that is 
absolutely awesome fun sized. Oh. <laughs> this is absurd. <laughs> oh man. Oh my my handle's loose. Holy cow. I think there's a couple catfish in here. <laughs> I'm I'm in kind of heaven right now. Oh. Round four, three? I can't even count. Well, if you want to know the pond catfish setup. Six out circle hook, and this chunk of crappie that I'm going to continue to use. 20 pound leader, swivel, sinker, slide, sinker. Two ounce weight, you don't need that much, but it's the lightest one I had, so. All right, how long is it gonna take this time? Am I gonna have time to make a cast for crappies? Maybe that's why there's no crappies here. They're scared they'll get eaten. I haven't had a bite in 30 seconds. I don't know what the deal is. I only have so much time because I get back in the turkey woods here for too long. All right, I'm going to step away, catfish. You're safe. Don't mind me. Oh. There's a fish. Oh, buddy. You're a dandy. You like the lightweight. Sweet. Well, found some craps. A crap. I think I'll uh I think I'll put him on the stringer too. You have a very diverse very diverse breakfast or dinner, whatever route we decide to go. Still can't believe how crazy that catfish action was there for a second. Spoiled. Now I have expectations. Well, I think it's time to freshen baits and move them slightly. I'm actually going to cast it. Ooh, don't scare me like that. I'm actually going to cast this one even closer, I think. One of them. Yep, right there. Yeah, that didn't take very long. Come on, bud. Not that active, apparently. So maybe we'll put this one over there. I didn't quite. Ooh. Got him that time. <laughs> Just needed to freshen baits and move them a little bit, I guess. Can't believe how shallow they are. And they're right next to the bank. I'd say, give them a hard time and say you're not fighting near as good as your buddies, but you know, you don't have much real estate to move. He's super dark. He hit it kind of weenie too. Maybe you are just a weenie. Come here. I don't know. I can literally not ask for anything more. Well, I could ask for another catfish. I think I will, because this is fun. I'm gonna put this one up there again, see what happens. Did I bump that or is that a bite? All right, back to the crap eyes. We're attempting to get the crap eyes. They haven't been as nice as the cats have been. But that would be a tall order. Oh, hey. <laughs> I didn't even hear the bite, I heard him splashing. Replying to my buddy's text. 
They're just in the hot corner over there. <laughs> this is bordering moderately absurd. I like it. This might be some, I mean, I've never tore up the channel cats in a pond. I've caught channel cats in a pond, but I've never had a day where I'm like, oh man, this is crazy awesome. Until today. In a real time update, it's been about a half hour. I mean, they're all the same size. That's okay, because that size is very nice. Ooh, he's barely hooked. Barely's enough. See you, bud. This will put it in the hot corner again. Literally, I walked by over there and I saw something move and kicked up some dirt or whatever. And I'm like, I bet those are catfish or carp. And I don't think there's carp in here. So I feel like this kind of confirms the likelihood that what I saw was catfish. I'm gonna walk away again. Man, what a crappy day. I mean, not like crappy fishing. I'm crap. The weather's not that nice, <laughs> but the cats don't seem to care. I saw that. I was just thinking about moving it. No, he's still there. Yep. <laughs> yep, I was just thinking about moving this one. He decided to move it for me. It's pretty intense farm pond action. Well, he's running at me. Oh yeah, another nice fish. Ooh, he about hit me in a tender area with that sinker. Do I move? I mean, I'm having fun. Kind of want to see if I can catch him somewhere else. Or if this is just the hot spot. Sweet. Another fine, fine pond specimen right there. Come back soon. I'm beating up my walleye crappy rod in the name of catfish. i live with that. I wonder how many crappy jokes I could, uh, Make it under a minute. Man, this is some crappy, crappy fishing. All right, I'll stop. Won't put you through that. The catfishing ain't. Ha, 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 ha. All right, seriously, I'll quit. All right, let's, uh, let's move and try one more spot. Just because I want to know if there's fish there too. I think there should be. The geese do not like me here. They'll get over it. Oh, there's a, what was once a nice catfish. It's probably a sign, maybe? I don't know. Give it a few minutes. Get close to this inlet. Stands to reason that if they were by one inlet, they'd be by another one. The wind was blowing into that one a little bit more. Oh, we'll try it. Ain't gonna hurt nothing to try it. Take it down. Yep, they're in this pocket too. <laughs> they might just be everywhere. He's an ugly one. I appreciate him either way. Nothing like some good old simple pond fishing that I have not enjoyed for a while. Another nice one. See ya. Just slinking on the bottom. How many of those things are in here? It's almost getting crazy. There he is. 
the muskrat. I actually don't mind muskrats. It's the beavers I'm not a big fan of. Beavers are jerks. Ooh, did I just get a bump? I don't know. I do know I need to uh, get those fish cleaned and get into the turkey woods before it's too late. It might already be too late, but uh, I will see you at the dinner table or probably brunch table. Fish and eggs sound amazing. Morning, turkeys hunting went well. So that was a plus. It's gonna make this breakfast taste even better than it already would. But we got fish filleted and we got eggs. So we're gonna make fish and eggs and it's quite wonderful. What's your opinion on fish and eggs? Love it. Okay, I thought you might say that. <laughs> the goal for these is to make them as crispy as possible. This crispy stuff complements eggs well. I'm gonna chunk them up. You could do the whole filet, and we might with the crappies because they're thin, but with the cats, make nuggets. The goal is to have a whole big batch of crappies, but not the case. We'll make do though. There's still more springtime for that, and it doesn't feel much like spring. We replace the nasty fish juice in here with Frank's Red Hot. You can you handle the extra hot? That's all I got. Yes. Okay. Apparently I have rhymes though. Practically a wrapper. And with the catfish I cut all the red meat off. And that's the key to making it not taste fishy. Liberally apply Frank's. I'm gonna let that sit for about 10 minutes or so. And then the golden crispiness begins. How many eggs do you think you want? Two. Two? Okay. I think that's all I'm gonna have is two. So that's gonna be a lot of fish. These look fiery. They're gonna be good. Suppose I can get the oil hot. That would be a logical progression of events at this point. That's the rumor. Yep. The breading does go pretty far. I mean, if I was smart, I would have taken these out and put them in a different bag that way. Oh yeah, they would, yeah, it would have went a lot farther. But it, it still, like it still did pretty good. I think it'll be okay. Ooh, she's getting hot. That's one nice thing about the... Gas? Yeah. It's hot in her. Right? Yep. I find a significant amount of satisfaction when you take a little bit of breading and toss it into the oil and then it starts sizzling. We're not there yet. It's noon. Our breakfast became brunch and is now becoming just lunch. This skillet's big enough. We might be able to get through these pretty quick. Might have to do some slow motion action shots of the... Dipping in the oil? Dipping in the oil, yeah. Well, it looks like it's crispy. It is definitely crispy. Fish is gonna be good. I don't make promises I can't keep. You do the first one. Try my best. I think we're uh, first rounds complete. At least some of them are. And these fish are out of like 45 degree water, so they're going to taste even better. Did it come unglued? I tried to run away. Oh, did you catch it? I got one. Caught them twice now. We don't know you're quick and fast. Either. Right. I might have been stealing off of these while I was cooking them. My dad might have been too. I don't blame him. That's hot. You're right, there'll be just enough grease in there for you to do your eggs. Perfect. I think I'll leave that one a little yolky and then dip my fish in it. Ooh, that's what I do with like sausage when I make sausage. Yep. The fish are easier to catch than the eggs right now. The fish are already dead. The eggs aren't, can't run away either. Mm, around though, they can roll. That's true. What's the consensus? Very, very good. Very good. I'm pretty marginal at most things, but I feel very competent when it comes to frying fish and making breakfast. Sometimes grilling stuff, sometimes catching fish. 
but I definitely feel good about my fish frying ability. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit the like button. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. But Oh, if you want to check out my podcast, that'll be linked in the description too, and I'd really appreciate it. But thanks for taking time to watch. Hope you catch a giant. I'm going to stuff my face. Well, you're good at it. Yeah. yeah I'm, I'm better at eating the fish than any of that other stuff I talked about.